How does this look? Pretty good. Testing out the vlogging setup because in this video, we will be going to Wheel Fun Weekend 4. That's right, super pumped. Driving out there tomorrow. But before I do, I'm just gonna gotta do a couple housekeeping things on the GT. And I thought I'd just explain it real quick because this is what I'm gonna be testing out while I'm out there. So first things first, we're gonna put some GT bangs on later because they didn't arrive in time. Unfortunately, they're gonna be delivered while I'm out of town. So instead, I went through my boxes and boxes of bumpers to find the least scratched up one that I could. And apparently it's this green one. So I'm gonna throw the green bumper on the back. Is the back? Yep, on the back. So that hopefully I got a little more plastic on there. Next thing I'm gonna do is slap on these low boys. That's right. I managed to secure some low boys from a friend for a pretty good deal. Thank you, Corey. And I just really wanna try them out. I've got the flat kicks on the front right now and I've got the cush wide on the back, which have been great. Don't have any real issues with them, but a lot of people like these ones. And so I figured I'd pick them up, give them a try and see how they feel. But just in case, I'm bringing these ones with me because if I need to swap back, well, then I have them with me, so. And then last but not least, I did get another package that I'm super excited about. This one right here. Can you read that? I can't tell if it's in focus. Hopefully this camera has it in focus. Inside this box from Oak City Shred Solutions is the electrolytes for the GT. And if you don't know what this is, basically it is a small little circuit board that you put inside your controller that can take your stock LED headlight and taillight and turn them into RGB lights. That's right. If you, in case you didn't know, if you look really closely at these lights, they're RGB lights. For whatever reason, Future Motion never allowed us to change it until the GTS came out, where now you can just make the front ones yellow for fog lights. Um, okay. But yeah, I've known all along that they were RGB lights. You could literally see it if you look really closely. This is supposed to make them RGB. So we're gonna throw that on there and hopefully get it working so that we can show it off at Wheel Fun Weekend. Yeah. Oh, one more thing before I forget, because I'm seeing it, maybe you've seen it too. Question for anybody who has the performance treaded tire from Future Motion. Is yours leaking like in between all the tread? Like I've got little wet spots in between my tread and thankfully I'm not really losing much PSI. I'm guessing the, the uh, tire sealant is doing its job, but yeah, it's just a little concerning. So wanted to put that out there to see if other people are experiencing it. Still love the tire, it rides great. I ride faster than I've ever ridden, which is both a good and bad thing. But anyways, I'm gonna throw all this stuff on, then I'm gonna drive out to San Diego for a wheel fun weekend, show you what that's all about. And afterwards, I'll tell you what I think about the low boys, the electrolytes, and of course, the whole event. All right, I'll see you guys there. Welcome to San Diego. Just got to Henry's Pub. We a little early, but party's about to get started. Hey. Chair. <laughs> More gel blasters. <laughs> oh, I apologize. I don't have to stop.
Day two, wheel fun weekend. We're gonna feel a good float. Found Ren again. Yeah. Yeah, craft and rise here. I just saw that text message. We need both of you people you know, holding bags and doing trash grabbing. I get this garbage right here. Oh, got it. Back here. Hold up. There's a piece of trash right here. Let me just let me just get this and put it in my. my, my. Here, let me help you get this trash. Get this trash out of here. Jeez. Who left this thing here? <laughs> here we, we, we gotta, we gotta we, get this trash out. Uh, can you put this in my? Can you put this in my bag? Get this, dude. It's we gotta fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> can't just leave that stuff lying
What is up, guys? Last night was a lot of fun, but today, today is race day. So we padding up. We're gonna see how we do. Check it out. Hey, good. Going, man. We got Crafton right here. Look, we got here. One wheel themselves is here. Hopefully it doesn't rain this time. Yeah. Wrap up practice. We'll get ready to go on at 2 o'clock. Sounds good? Woo. I'd also thank everybody. Have a fun day. Woo. Woo. How are you feeling? Yeah, nervous? My, my thighs. You last year, right? I did. And I ate it on the way after it started raining. Yeah, same. I also ate it. I haven't raced a whole lot, but I've raced this like a few times now. What is your What is your other strategy? You have any For this? Yeah. Lean forward on the downhill. Parts. Like, because yes. you go up and it's like you're gonna want uh, the board's gonna want to tail drag yeah, really right. hard. I've been so, you that. have to really, really lean over the front end and, okay. and you gotta like really dial in exactly when to start leaning back because it's before you hit the bottom. Yes. But you gotta lean forward basically as you're hitting the crack. Also, get the deepest squat you can get. I so, like, as you're like burns. way more than you think. Yeah, I, I know, I know it burns, but like that'll help because uh, it's like. The inertia of your body, the less you, you can move your body, the better. So it's like if you got a hill coming up, uh, basically kind of jump into it, but at the top of the hill, you gotta be in the deepest squat you can be. And so then when you're going down the hill, it's just your legs going down. So the mass, right. most of the mass of your body is not really moving that much. So what you're saying is I should just be an Oompa Loompa. Yeah. Well, yeah. Oompa do. -doo. Sunday fun day, the last day, real fun weekend here. It's just happening and uh, yeah, enjoy the day. <laughs> Me and yeah. dirt. Victory pizza, baby. <laughs> Check out these mini 
I know, that was a long one, so thank you so much if you made it this far. There was just too much fun that I had to share, and you know me, I gotta spread the stove. As you already saw, Woo! there were a ton of group rides, and I got to hang out with so many awesome people. And hey, I improved on my race game this year. In fact, I finished fifth in the open amateur division. Not bad for having to compete against GTSs and VESCs, eh? By the way, there are a ton more photos. Just check out the video description for an album link and feel free to share and tag your friends. Oh, I almost forgot. Just a quickie on the, the board updates that I made. The low boy foot pads, they work fine. Well, after I removed the layer of clear plastic over the sensor, because you, you know how that, how that goes. And the electrolytes were a hit and I think looked cool as heck. I just have one bug with them that I'm ironing out with the developer. So I'm thinking I'll save that for a dedicated video. Anyways, big thanks to my good friend Jeremiah for taking my camera and shooting most of the race day photos while I was busy on the track. Also, thank you to Shannon, AKA Berserkel, for additional footage of myself. Oh, nice. If you haven't checked out her YouTube channel, you should because she rocks. I'll make sure and link it down below. And of course, thank you to everybody who helped make Wheel Fun Weekend happen again this year. I got to connect with so many new faces and my float stoke is full of amazing new memories. Okay, okay, I've rambled on long enough, so that's Ginter for now. Um, I'm finally gonna put these bang bumpers on my GT and get back to shredding the AZ desert. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Do me a solid and do that thumbs up thing and make sure to sub if you haven't. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Oh, hey, um, one more bit of news. I'm a TFL Stoke team member now. So if you need a discount code for the Float Life, you know there'll be one in the description. All right.
Float on, my friends. Damn, my tire is still leaking. We just got a backup.